industrial design at Massey University, uh, a program that's both pragmatic and conceptual, uh, graduates people who are really well connected with the real world but also able to drive new innovative solutions. Uh, we really like the idea that we can understand the people that we're designing for, uh, both the people that exist in the world now and also the people that are going to inhabit the world that our products will uh, be in in the future. We spend a lot of time making things. Uh, our, our students spend a lot of time in the workshop, hands-on with materials, uh, shaping, forming uh, and experiencing what they design in a very personal way. And um, that's a distinctive element of this program. On top of that, as well as the traditional tools, the traditional workshop tools that we use, we have all the high-end digital tools. Uh, we have 3D printers, laser cutters, CNC machining abilities, and, and that gives us the, uh, the capacity to explore new ideas uh, and new processes in different ways. One of the great things about industrial design at Massey is the uh, environment, which is a, a lovely collaborative but competitive environment in the studio where you can build off each other's ideas and really improve your own skills at the same time. After graduating in 2007 here at Massey University, I since left to work in the feature film industry, uh, working for various producers and film directors such as Peter Jackson on the Hobbit trilogy. Myself coming back now, I realise that I can offer that knowledge uh, from the business um, freely to the students throughout the different layers of the course, so all the way from first year level 100 papers to final year papers and major research projects. One of the highest priorities within Mass University is preparing the students for actively being in the workplace. Um, that involves putting them in group uh, situations from the get-go, um, right away from first year all the way to fourth year, so that they can handle the pressures of deadlines um, out in the workforce today.